Hey everyone, my name is Jesse. I'm a pastor here in Seattle. It's great to connect with you and I love hearing from you. Please leave comments. You can share this video and send your prayer request as well. We pray for you. And I want to talk today about confession, confession to God. And unfortunately, in a lot of church services, confession is left out. It's almost like we're pretending that we don't sin against God or we don't need his grace on a daily basis. And confession is so healthy and it's a vital part of our relationship with God. We see this with David. He made some terrible mistakes. He slept with another man's wife and then he had that man killed and he didn't confess his sins. Now, when he finally decided to turn to the Lord and get right with God, you can check out Psalm 32 and Psalm 51. And he said, have mercy on me, O God, according to your great love and your faithfulness. God forgives. God is gracious. God is loving. No matter what you've done, uh, you can turn to him now and you can seek him and he will, he's faithful to bring forgiveness, restoration, and healing, but it starts with honest confession. First of all, why should we confess? Uh, because every day we sin, and sin hurts our relationship with God. Now, when you put your trust in Jesus, you have eternal life, and no one can take that away. Uh, that's his grace, salvation in his family forever. But when you sin, that hurts your relationship with God in terms of the quality of the relationship. You know, I have four children, and when they make bad mistakes, they're still my kids, and I still love them. But there needs to be some restoration. They need to uh, confess it. They need to change. And that really leads to, you know, what is confession? It's not just feeling sad about the consequences, and it's not just a quick admitting that you've done wrong. Confession's deeper. Confession is when you agree with God. Repentance means turn 180 degrees, and it includes some change. It's not just that, oh, I'm sorry about that, but I'm just going to go right back to the sin. No, the Bible says, as a dog returns to his vomit, so a fool returns to his folly. So we want to learn from our mistakes. God is gracious. He restores. He forgives. But then we want to walk with him, walk in the light, walk in a new direction. True confession is not just feeling bad about consequences, but it's agreeing with God, receiving his grace. Don't stay in guilt and shame. Don't stay in it. God doesn't want you to. But receive his grace and then walk in the light. Walk with him in a new direction. That could be 180 degrees. That could be some changes and adjustments. Maybe you stay far away from the porn shop or the bars or you stay far away from the temptation because the, as the old saying goes, if you stick around the barbershop long enough, you're going to get a haircut. And sometimes wisdom and confession includes new distance from the temptation as well. Well, who do we confess to? There's a lot of confusion with this topic. We can go right to God with confession. You don't have to pray to a priest or to someone else. Go right to God. God is right there. He listen wherever you are, any time of the day. He's always available 24-7. Go right to your Heavenly Father and confess your sins. And as you do that, He restores and He purifies and He changes, He hears. Now, it is okay to confess to somebody else. In the book of James, it says, confess your sins one to another that you may be healed. Use discernment who you confess uh, those sins to. You don't just want to uh, tell everyone in the world necessarily, but talk to people who are trustworthy friends, who you can confide in. And as you uh, do confess, they'll bring encouragement. Good friends will bring restoration. They'll share the word with you. They'll reassure you and they'll bring accountability. They'll help you and guide you out of that sin. So confess, of course, primarily to God, but sometimes it's good to share it with someone and to bring in some accountability into your life as well. Uh, when do you confess? Confess quickly. If you sinned, don't let it linger and wait a week to confess. Confess quickly and ask God to fill you with the Holy Spirit again. I hope these uh, just uh, views on confession that are biblical are also helpful because, like I say, there's a lot of confusion. And, uh, all right, I'm checking out Gabriel there. Uh, and, and leave in your comments where you're uh, watching from. It's so awesome we get to connect around the world. But I want to reassure you there's forgiveness of sins through Jesus Christ. There's no other way we can be forgiven but through his blood. Without his blood, there's no forgiveness of sins, but he shed his blood for us. He's perfect. He died in our place. He's human. He was without sin. He's also God. He's the one who takes away our sin and takes away our guilt and our shame. And with him, there's no condemnation. You know you can have eternal life and the forgiveness of sin. Spread the good news. You know, every other religion is struggling. How do you have forgiveness with a holy God? But there's one way. It's a bridge. There's one means. 
mediator. There's one savior of all mankind is Jesus Christ. So walk in that reassurance today that your sins are forgiven and then confess quickly, get right with God so that the quality of your relationship with God stays close. You abide with him. Watching from Malawi, watching from Kenya. Excellent. We love you, Africa. We love you, Asia. And just around the world, we're one family, God's family. So let's walk in the light today. Don't be in denial. Don't just stuff the truth. If you sin, get right with the Lord and uh, know that God is gracious. His character is uh, from the Philippines, Gabriel. His character reassures us that he's kind, he's merciful, where sin abounds, grace abounds all the more. All right, God Life family, I love you. Check out God Life TV for more videos and uh, let's walk in integrity. God is a lifter of our heads. Don't stay in shame. With Jesus, there's forgiveness of sins and joy in God's kingdom.